What is up, guys? It is Pyro Lighters here. Um, I am making this video at night, so I probably won't upload it until um tomorrow. As yeah, it's getting kind of late, and I really want to go to bed. So, um, I am making this quick video on my lighter that I just did. So as you guys can see. I have the vintage lens in the corner and the Pyro Pyramid logo. And then on the back, I upgraded the um, Pyro Lighters um, logo. As you guys could see, it is gold now. Um, so I think I did a good job on the P there. But um, if you guys watch the short, you'll see that um, I originally just outlined it and then I just recently. Um, I just recently shaded it in with the gold finish, so I think it looks amazing. It's actually brass. What am I saying? Gold. But I think that looks so cool, um, and it is probably my best um, Zippo customization. Actually, it's my only so far um, customization. So yeah, overall a very cool lighter customization so yeah um i just want to talk about that a little bit i mean i did so this letter is pretty hefty the new one that i just got um because i did put the butane torch insert into this one i just think it looks so much better um and so they're at the same amount of shine and everything i don't know it just looks a lot better than like my regular insert that was in there um I don't know. It just doesn't really fit the right. I don't know. It just doesn't really look the same as a good old butane. So I just put the butane insert in there, you know? It's my letter. I can do what I want, right? Um, I am also in my future videos, um, probably upcoming at like the end of this month or whatever, um, or maybe beginning of next, I am going to. Um, be making a video um i'm getting a zoro lighter so we are going to see how the machine does f the machine um hinge works for tricks um i know i've worn these lighters down with tricks as you guys can see in all my videos i do tricks um and so i've been tricking on these lighters for like a long time i mean sure zippos are like really um reliable and everything but just that hinge right there the five little barrel hinge that it has I don't think that's gonna last up to the amount of tricking I'm gonna be doing as you guys can see it's welded on the inside if you guys know zippos you know that it's welded on the inside already as you guys can see there it's also on the top so I mean zippo went from the um vintage look replicas um from the hinge being on the outside to the hinge being welded on the inside because this insert gives that welding a compact thing on the inside. So now it's like compact in there and everything. And it's just overall a very good hinge. But I need the mach machined hinge for tricking. Like I just had to fix this hinge tonight. Um, it was totally closed. Now I got it a little bit better. Where there is a tiny bit of gap between the lid and the base of the lighter. You guys can see on this one. My brand new one, look how much gap is there, and then look at the one that I've been tricking on a ton. I mean, you guys could see the wear and tear there between the gaps. So, just a reminder, like, if you're going to be tricking, I would probably get a Zorro lighter. Um, but I'm going to do a full review on the Zorro lighter. So, yeah, stay tuned for that. I feel like that will be a very fun upcoming sort of video. So... Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and we will see you guys next time. Bye.